Would you say that each chakra has something like a original want or expression? What it really wants to be like? I had experienced this yesterday. There was being present here and now in the root chakra, pure aliveness and enjoyment in the sacral, just love and being loved as the only one that is in the heart. I recognize that all the personal wants are not really so fulfilling like this original want. Yeah, I would. So there's two, there's different things. So each chakra has an original want. And then there's the original want of yourself, of the person. And the original want of the person actually is just to be at home. It's just to be free, is to be who you are. And that manifests in a way in the feeling body as well. Um, but the, the chakras don't always have to be in positive. That's not freedom. It's, like it's not about that. But the chakras do have original wants. And it's all connected to the psychology of the chakras, like what the feelings are there. So the want of the heart is to love. The want of the throat is to express love. The want of the... Um, of the um, third eye is to for compassion, to understand, to see, and this is to connect to something bigger. The sacral, the, the solar plexus chakra is action, the want for action. I mean, these are just for me. I'm not sure what everyone else would say about this in the chakra world. Um, the sacral chakra is creativity, and the root chakra, I would say, is actually love, like groundedness in this love. So they all have original wants. Um, and then slightly beyond that, or beyond that, is your own heart's want. And your own heart's want is to be home. So this is who you are, right here, right now. And that, that recognition and that feeling, I think, lifts up the chakras and makes them all vibrate with positivity.